Good evening everyone, um, welcome to another video and this is based around uh, the battery problems that I'm getting at the moment um, as you can see uh, I'm just flying my Scout uh, and I'm using it to basically drain the battery to do my battery testing uh, it's currently in GPS mode and um, the wind was well it wasn't calm today, it was a bit all over the place um, it was fluctuating a bit in height as well um, when I was on a steady throttle. But anyway, um, so I've taken off on 23.9 volts. Um, and obviously with this, um, it's basically flying to see uh, how far I can go before I then land it. And the plan was to land it at 21.6 uh, volts and then basically test what battery I had left um, through my uh, balancer so what do we discover so at 21.7 volts I had 4.03 per cell uh, working out at 24 volts so still plenty of juice in so up again for the second flight uh, I'm gonna sort of start we're now sort of pushing the limits of potentially how far I can go uh, based on the recommended settings um, and I was planning to land it at 21 volts uh, and see how uh, the balancer or what the balancer was going to say um, again very windy day uh, it was very all over the place uh, and something that um, I wouldn't necessarily recommend. The uh, satellites are also quite poor as well. I only had three. It's not recommended to really fly on three, but I really wanted to get this uh, this sorted. So, landing it, what did we come up with? Well, at 21 volts, I was getting 23.33 still left in. So again, still pretty much loads of uh, energy left in that battery so we went for the third flight um, to test it again uh, the the plan here was basically I was going to drop it again by, by about 0.5 of a volt so 20.5 I was going to run it down to and test it there see how that goes because I, I I am starting to push the limit and I don't really want to damage the, the battery any more than I have to um, or I don't want to damage the battery at all it's the only one I've got and so the idea behind this was to just fly it and actually at the beginning the battery does drain quite quickly and then after a while it sort of starts to even out and it did take me a while to drop point right down well drop 0.5 of a volt down um, so yeah um, we were just literally waiting for the 0.5 of a volt to come down and then uh, plug it into the balancing charger to see what I get and to be honest I probably could have flown more um, because when I did land it uh, it's, it's still relatively good on those cells um, what I got was uh, 22.76, uh, still working at 3.79 volts. So all in all, actually, not too bad. So here's a little screenshot of my findings. Um, and I've now adjusted my transmitter to uh, buzz um, now at 20.5 volts. Thanks for watching. Um, and please subscribe for more videos from the Scout and I will catch up with you again shortly.